The Bermuda Triangle, also known as the Devil Triangle, is an area bounded by points in Bermuda, Florida and Puerto Rico, where ships and planes are said to mysteriously vanish into thin air or deep water. Recently some people have wondered if there is a Bermuda Triangle connection in the disappearance of Malaysia Airlines flight AMH370, even though the jet was missing half away around the world. The term Bermuda Triangle was coined in 1964 by writer Vincent Geddes in the man's Pupil magazines are so. Though Geddes first came up with the phrase, a much more famous name propelled into the international popularity a decade later, <laughs> Charles Berlitz, whose family created the popular series of language instruction courses, also had a strong interest in the paranormal. He believed not only that Atlantis was real, but also that it was connected to the triangle in some way, the theory he proposed in his best-selling 1974 books, The Bermuda Triangle. The mystery has since been promoted in thousands of books, magazines, television shows and websites. Over the years many theories have been afforded to explain the mystery. Some writers have expanded upon Berlin's ideas about Atlantis, suggesting the mythical city may lie at the bottom of the sea and be using its reputed crystal energies to sink ships and planes. Other more fanciful suggestions include time portals and extraterrestrials, including rumors of underwater alien bases. Still others believe that the explanation lies in some sort of extremely rare and little known, yet perfectly natural, geological or hydrological explanation. For example, perhaps ships and planes are destroyed by pockets of flammable methane gas known to exist in large quantities under the sea. Maybe lightning or an electrical spark ignited a huge bubble of metal that came to the surface right next to the ship or plane, causing them to sink without a trace. There are a few obvious logical problems with this theory, including that methane exists naturally around the world and such an incident has never been known to happen. Others suggest sudden road tidal waves, or maybe some mysterious geomagnetic anomaly that creates navigation problems confusing pilots and somehow causing them to plug into the ocean. Then again, pilots are trained to fly even with low electronic navigation and that theory doesn't explain the ship disappears. In fact, the Navy has a web page debunking this idea. It has been incorrectly claimed that the point of Bermuda is one of the two places on the Earth at which a magnetic compass points towards the true north. Normally a compass will point toward the magnetic north. The difference between the two is known as the compass variation. Although in the past this compass variation did affect the Bermuda Triangle region due to its location in the Earth's magnetic field, this has apparently not been the case since the 19th century.